Hey Doug, how's it going? It's cold out today. It's supposed to be the first day of spring. Whew, it's cold. It's like minus five. Never mind ruts and ice and snowbanks in Saskatoon. Where's spring? Where's baseball? Sorry Doug, it's a little chilly outside there. It's like minus five. I don't know if I already said that, but that's cold. And I'm sorry there's no dude in the back seat today. Now, I know that you've followed baseball for many, many of the years of your life, and I'm just a newbie to the sport. And you might ask, you know, Darren, why did you start following baseball last year? What made you decide? I don't know. I really don't know. So last spring, I chose a team that I was going to follow throughout the year. I decided that I was going to try to pick a team that I could, you know, invest some time into, that I could say... You know, this is going to be my team, and not just my team for the year, but I'm going to follow baseball, and I'm going to follow this team. So I put a lot of thought into it, and I ended up choosing the Chicago Cubs to be my team. The most losingest team in the last hundred odd years. Did you know that Thunder Bay was home to the 2010 World Junior Baseball Championships? Well, it was took Jenny to one of the games. We saw Canada versus Panama. Any team that wanted to play that night had to have the first letter of the alphabet as every second letter in their name. That's a joke, but it's true. But here's where you come in, Doug. I was thinking that this year, in order to make baseball more exciting for me, I could choose, like, a backup team. So I was hoping that maybe you would help me choose this second team. Because, you know, you know baseball a lot better than I do. You're the baseball guy. Here's some criteria that I've come up with to help choose this additional team. I should have some sort of regional affiliation with the team. Some place that I've visited or lived at or... I don't know. Somehow I have to have some sort of affiliation with the region that the team plays in. I'll let you work out what that means. I'm also hoping that the team that you'll help me choose will be somewhat rewarding to follow. Now, I don't want a shoe in I don't want a guaranteed winner, because, you know, that's not that exciting. But, you know, it'd be fun if, if they weren't bottom of the barrel. Like, I'm not looking for the Pirates or something like that. And here's maybe the hardest part. I'd like to follow a team that's got some sort of history, some sort of mythos, some sort of soul. The Chicago Cubs certainly have that, but not all teams do. I don't think I want to follow the Blue Jays. The regular season starts in just over a week, so I'm hoping that you'll help me to pick an additional baseball team to follow this year. I know you'll steer me right. I'll see you later this week. No, I won't. I'll see you early next week.